four legs. So my best estimate for the number of legs this creature has entirely is about 350 to 400 I legs. Say. I haven't counted them all lately, so I'm <laughs> positive about the exact. But it's kind of a hard surface. Yeah, it is hard. They are important as decomposers in the forest. They feed on uh, fallen fruit and decaying leaves and so forth, and they'll help convert that into soil. So in nature, they're very, very important in that regard. They don't bite. They're not poisonous. Uh, nothing uh, really to worry about. How do they protect animals. themselves? Um, they will protect themselves by sometimes secreting things around the outside of them that will make them distasteful to yeah. animals so they don't, you know, are not eaten as readily and so forth. So. All right. but, and I feed them apple and things of that nature, basically, as a, as a source of food. Well, let's get to my favorite, cockroaches. Cockroaches. Okay, here we go. I love finding these in corners. These I will uh, bring out with the piece of wood that they're on. That looks like a southern cockroach. This is a, a type of yeah. a cockroach called the Madagascar hissing cockroach. Oh, are these the ones that are edible? Oh, I suppose oh, some people oh, might try it. Good. I can't say that I have myself, however. So, and sometimes they will make a noise. They hiss. They hiss sometimes. Sometimes they don't hiss. If they're upset. If they're upset. If they're they're so upset. used to me now. And yeah, they're they're used they attack when they're upset. They will just make kind of a hissing noise, and that's to deter uh, predators from coming out. They attack so in bunches, don't they? Right. Can you well, imagine a bunch of them all over you? Well, as I say, they. <laughs> I don't. I never worry about that. I never worry about we that. We have to wrap this up. So okay. Ten seconds. Who's okay. this little guy? This little, little guy right, right here. This, this over here is a uh, whip scorpion. Okay. Oh, a scorpion. Whip scorpion. You don't, don't forget. We don't want you to forget to try the animal bar. That's in the Mexico. Oh, you flavor. serious about us eating these? Yes, you serious. And we're going to have it at buffet on well, Sunday. So yeah, we'll what are these? Or the public? Here it is. Little larva. This is a whip scorpion. It's very crunchy. And uh, this lives in Mexico. Lives in Mexico. <laughs> this lives in Mexico, okay. in the, in the uh, desert area and so forth. They call it a whip scorpion because of the flagellum so and the antenna form legs. Now, is he dangerous? Not really dangerous. It defends itself in one particular way, which gives rise to its other name of vinegaroon. Uh, if they're attacked by an animal that might want to eat them, they can shoot out from their abdomen a fine mist of acetic acid solution, which is what you find uh, in vinegar, hence the name vinegaroon. So I kind of look at them as being the skunk of the arachnid world, if you know what I mean. They I understand. Same strategy, basically. Same okay. strategy. So. Well, well, this is very fun. This, this, is, is, this, this is, is very tasty. Yeah. Are you guys coming back? Or is it? Uh, no, I've got mine. Thanks. <laughs> I'm like John the Where is Bud Day? Can you tell us? This Bud Day is coming up this Sunday uh, at the Penitentiary Blend. Yes, that's uh, right. Michael Clark's Penitentiary Blend. Mm -hmm. Michael Clark. Yes. What, noon and so forth? And uh, the admission is free. Yes, it's free, it's fun, lots of activities, and kids can earn a bugology degree. Oh, get yeah. out. All about I think Wayne has earned his, that's for sure, because that's tarantula is building a web on your arm. He is. <laughs> <laughs> no, no, we'll try to brush that He's off before. Very comfortable. <laughs> comfortable. This is the bravest I've ever been. How do you feel? Good? I feel good. <laughs> <laughs> can you read the next line of the teleprompter? <laughs> okay. 647 is first of all.